Hello, my name is David Reynolds and I run Atlantic Geothermal, a geothermal energy consulting company working to provide new energy for New England. I would like to tell you about the vast potential of geothermal energy. The Department of Energy refers to it as a virtually unlimited supply of energy once we learn how to tap into it. This is not something that should be overlooked or considered passe. On a small scale, geothermal energy can be used to heat and cool residences and public buildings. On a large scale, it can produce clean, efficient electricity. If you are interested in making a significant contribution to society, something that would greatly help future generations, this could be your chance to make a difference. I believe recent technological advances have made possible a new class of geothermal power plant capable of producing far more power than today's largest geothermal power plants. Of course, developing new technologies is never easy. Failure often precedes success. Innovation has a high cost. However, our nation has benefited greatly when the development of new technologies has made manifest our dreams and ideas. This principle underlies much of our nation's success. Politicians, scientists, and industrial leaders have been taking an interest in a geothermal canal, a large tunnel running through the deep earth at a depth of 20,000 feet, and producing 1,600 megawatts of electricity as part of a geothermal power plant. This is comparable to the Hoover Dam's production of 1,700 megawatts. The technology exists to make this happen. For example, oil companies are drilling wells to a depth of 30,000 feet using hydrostatic pressure to counteract the lithostatic pressure experienced at such depths. The same concept is being considered as the means for building a new type of tunnel desirable for reaching great depths where the rocks are extremely hot. Of course, the environment at these depths is too hostile for people, so robotic equipment would be used. This, along with many technological requirements of a massive project of this scale, will create demand for the very best engineers. To be sure, the cost of employing a large number of highly skilled people would be significant. but. So the benefits of success would be tremendous. Geothermal energy has many advantages. It is safe, clean, and reliable. With most of its infrastructure located below ground, it is considered to have a relatively small surface footprint with a minimal impact on local communities. It is deemed to be one of the more reliable forms of alternative energy. Hydroelectric is dependent upon a good rainfall. Wind is dependent upon a steady breeze. And solar is dependent upon good sunny days. Not so with geothermal. Heat rises from the deep earth at a steady rate. Did you know that 99% of the earth has a temperature greater than 1000 degrees Celsius? You may wonder if geothermal energy has so many advantages and is so abundant, why well, we don't produce more of it. In my opinion, the answer is basic economics. Fossil fuels can be extracted with a high degree of efficiency at a relatively low cost. In contrast, extracting heat from hot rocks is more challenging. More advanced technologies will be required to be able to produce the same amounts of electricity already produced by fossil fuels. To be sure, there is an unlimited amount of energy stored below ground in the form of hot rocks. The question remains, are we up to the challenge of learning how to extract that energy efficiently?